We are back with Dr. Dwayne Elmore, who is our Extension Specialist for Natural Resource Ecology and Management. And today we're going to talk about a pattern that we often see on some of our soft trees. Um, what is it that's making this? Yeah, yellow-bellied sapsucker is actually the, the woodpecker that's causing damage. Okay, and so they have a few species of plants that they prefer. Yeah, generally it's uh, trees that produce a lot of sap when they're injured, so pines, um, maples, um, fruit trees, mm -hmm. and viburnums. Okay, and what's the telltale sign of that pattern that makes us think that it would be a yellow belly sapsucker? It's really regular. Um, sometimes it'll be small circular holes in a, in a distinct pattern, okay. uh, horizontal or vertical, um, and it's, it's shallow. It's usually, they're just penetrating into the inner bark into mm -hmm. the cambium, they're not actually creating cavities. Okay, and, and we have a, some right here behind us on this viburnum actually, which a lot of times we think of them on trees, that's mm -hmm. a little bit more common, but we have identified, and this is fresh damage. Yes. So what is the season for these yellow belly sap suckers? So they're migratory and they usually come in October and depart in March or April. So it's pretty much just a winter issue and typically it's late winter, early spring when people are out starting to work in their garden that they notice the damage that's accumulated all winter. Okay, so like us here, we're seeing this now. Um, what can we do about it? Is there anything we can do about it? There's not a whole lot you can do to prevent this. Uh, the birds are protected um, as a migratory bird, so you can't uh, legally kill them. Fortunately, it's very unusual that this damage actually causes mortality to a tree. Okay, but on something small, it can kind of girdle some of these smaller branches, but it's not gonna kill the overall plant. Correct. Okay, so this is just a case where we've got a nice garden and we've got to appreciate the wildlife that comes with it. Right. All right, well, thank you for sharing with us. You're welcome. We hope you enjoyed this video. It's part of our Oklahoma Gardening YouTube channel. You can also find even more videos on our OK Gardening Classics YouTube channel. And join us on social media for great gardening tips, photos, and discussion.